We're here with our mascot, the Story Dude. So please, like the video, subscribe to Story Dude, and let's get into the stories. What's the scariest story you know of with actual photographic proof? Dot. This is a series of photos recovered from the camera of a Canadian couple who died during the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami. It shows the water level flowing out from the shore before surging back in. The very idea of a wall of water crashing towards you, completely unstoppable, and you have nowhere to run, nowhere that is safe is perhaps one of the most terrifying things that could happen to you. By the time one could take these photos, all you can do is watch death march inexorably towards you. Probably the Delphi murders where the girls took a photo and recorded audio, video of the killer. Still hasn't been caught sad face. Edit. Oh right link. A man took a photo of his family at the exact moment he was gunned down. This happened on New Year's Eve of 2011, and it was very tragic. Not sure if you can consider this scary, but to me, it was and still is. Cops of Reddit What is the saddest thing a criminal has said? Having to charge a person for a sex crime, when you investigated them as a child victim years before. His mother had that same expression of despair each time. Edit. Incredible response. I can provide a bit of update. The adult was a very young man at the time, and I think the system thought he was salvageable. A couple years later, I saw him working in a fast food restaurant. Seemed to be in good shape, interacting with his co-workers well. Neither of us acknowledged each other. I haven't seen him in any trouble since then. What is something you find really cringe? Listening my recorded voice. Recording yourself crying on social media. Family bloggers. Constantly having your life recorded as a child can really fuck you up. Especially since a lot of the time the parents are just using their children for content. My mind randomly replaying an embarrassing moment I've done that I want to forget. Skylar White singing happy birthday to Ted as Marilyn Monroe. People whose entire personality is based on which political party they support. What franchise had been milked to death? A better question would be what franchise hasn't been milked to death. Something like 9 out of 10, blockbusters, these days are remakes, sequels, rehashes etc. MTV's Teen Mom. Although they still act like teenagers, the moms are in their 30s. Certainly nothing Netflix has created. Get hooked on a show with solid potential and bam. Dot it's cancelled. Is the next Halloween really going to be the last one or no? Marvel. It used to be a big event when they released projects. Now new things are coming out every month. Quality has gone down. Call of Duty. 